Viaduct was included in TF2 of the classless update of 2009. Alongside versions for Nucleus and Sawmill, it introduced the King of the Hill game mode. Both teams fight over a centre point. Valve released videos showing this map's creation using an unreleased extended version of Rocket Jump Waltz. The TF team claimed this was the first TF2 map to feature snow. This was not correct. As punishment for their lies, the TF2 announced the forced map creator Corey Peters to bludgeon his hard drive with a stapler before he was bludgeoned by a crack security team. Map artist Zabif Ng was launched into space. Today's version of the update page credits Ace Gekmo's CP Glacier as one of the first TF2 maps with snow. In 2011 for Scream Fortress, Iaduct was released a spooky version of Viaduct. On Loot Island, when the Bombonomicon is observed from the back, you can see it costs $6.66 and has a summary and reviews on the back.